fabulous, wonderful. And so, yay, here we are. My thank yous, thank you to our fabulous mu musicians, Carl, Jamie, Peggy, oh my goodness, you blew the roof off this place, yay. <laughs> to our choir, to the band, thank you, thank you. To all of those who made this amazing day happen, to Ken Brown, Debbie McDonald, Callie Holmes Sorensen, Barbara King, Pat Karras, our practitioner class, all of our amazing volunteers at Seaside, the ministerial students. Oh my goodness, thank you so much for all you've done today. And before we pray out, I'm going to invite you to, for everyone in the, uh, I'll give a little, one more direction. And that's it. Um, we're going to have a benediction and then we'll have our procession out. So I'm going to ask everybody who's not in a robe to just relax for a couple of minutes as the procession makes its way outside. And then please join us out in the garden for our reception. And um, for those of you who have just become practitioners, or for those of you who are practitioners in the room, we're going to talk about that call for a minute. <laughs> this is the next step. If you're still hungering for something, if you're waiting and you're listening to that voice that says, go on, go on, it's time to take the step. Let's talk about the call of your heart. Come and spend some time with me. No pressure. <laughs> <laughs> it's my passion and my ministry to support the growth of spiritual leadership in this world in any way that it takes shape. And this week, we're going to have an open house for the Holmes Institute here at Seaside on Saturday morning on the 13th. And so I'll invite you to join us and just come and explore that call, see what's happening, where that voice is taking you, and what we can do to support you in the growth of being the light in the world. And so I congratulate you, I celebrate you, I thank you, and I thank everyone for being here. And so with that, I will invite Reverend Diane Hogan forth to give us the benediction. And so it's my honor to do the closing benediction, my honor and my privilege and my joy. And so please join with me and go within, turn within to that incredible space of the lightness of being, the lightness of pure spirit that has been evoked throughout this entire celebration, through the music, through the word, through the presence of each graduate, through each minister, each practitioner, and all of those who have supported them. How grateful I am to recognize God as each one, the light of pure spirit in form, the love divine that has sent out a call since before time began, and to recognize this day that we are the living witnesses of the call in manifestation. And so in gratitude, for this living presence that continues to light our way. I bless and give thanks for this time together. I know that the divine light of pure spirit continues to light the way for all of our graduates and for all of us. And I simply say, and so it is, amen. Amen.
Again, a lot of heart and soul and passion. Divine love, through me, blesses and multiplies all that I am, all that I give, and all that I receive. I am prosperous now.